And then we know let's oops. Okay. Not oop yeah, but um or move ya. <laughs> boop, move, <boop>, whatever. <laughs> so I've been a little, a little busy this summer. So I got a couple things. I uh, got yeah. two unboxings and I have a review. So I don't remember what about these. I don't know. May, June, I don't know. But they were two packs. Oops. Uh, this one's the jar with the feather in it. I'm going to probably cut that one off next. Um, and so here is the light bulb. So I will put pictures in so you see what it looks like when the um, lights are off. Because I did add some glow in the dark. So I added like glow in the dark here, here, here to all the spots that are supposed to be like the 38. 65 the white right yeah 38 65 wherever that white is supposed to be the eye I added glow in the dark instead because it's like a light bulb so uh the other ad I made where I put in some deep heated sparklers her original sparklers I put some purple and blue ones in the, in the butterfly and then I did some yellow ABs in one of the yellows I replaced so it's not exactly done the way it's charted I and, and that's what's fun about this 30 by 40s I mean everything else is good on this stick was good on it the symboling was nice and clear I could read all of the symbols nice and clearly you know there was no confusion um, it is a little busy I think it could be a better picture if it was a 40 by 50 but for a fun 20 by 30 I'm going to um, probably put it on my metal frame to have up as like a temporary one to change them out so I will seal it and put magnets on the back to put it on the back of my mag to put it on my magnetic frame that I change them out with so yeah so I thought that one was fun plenty of drills obviously because I uh, I borrowed some anyway I also have I've picked up a few things at the Dollar General and at the Dollar Tree is framing ideas. So I thought if we'd get into that a little bit because sometimes I forget to throw stuff in like that. And it's not enough to make just one video. So let me go grab what I think I'm going to do in these frames. Hold on. Okay, so my daughter wanted a couple of the little paint gem ones for her room. Like the mermaid, I did the rainbow edition so she loved the rainbow mermaid there's a castle she wanted to so i thought these have a hook to go that way um, would be simple solution but you're gonna have to like probably gonna either have to put double-sided tape to that or put down like a light glue to glue it to it. So there's that. And then I found this cute little wooden chalkboard, which has no way to hang it, but I can obviously put one of little hook things on the back. I thought a chalkboard could be a cute if you've got those really fancy chalkboard markers you could write the you know, person's name on it that would be cute or just a simple um, this one actually I think this is, if you wanted to paint it and then glue this on you know take one of the colors like that really pretty pink or one of the really pretty teal and then um, glue it to there. That'd be a quick, easy framing. I mean, it's ideas, different things sometimes pop into my head when I see stuff. I mean, these are cheap to buy at, 
you know, dollar store, dollar general, because they're, you know, not too fancy and too expensive. And if you just want something like, obviously stuff like this is, you know, only until my daughter is going to be done with it. And maybe you did like a, you know, like a little small diamond painting, you know, sm about that, about the size of this frame, then this would be a good way to frame something small like that if you, could, if you really liked it. And it was something you definitely wanted to put up. I mean, this would make an easy, quick you know, present to go with somebody's you know, gift card or something. If you want something, if you wanted to give them something you made but didn't want to make a huge one, you could always get a paint gem kit and like they have plants and um, your zodiac signs, different ones you could definitely make as part of gifts for somebody. That would be a cute idea. So that's what I got with that. Um, I did decide to go ahead and try this out. Um, I have ordered Art Dot cases and I've ordered uh, Art Dot drills, like AB drills and replacement drills back when I first started and I ran out of a couple colors before I had a collection. So this is the stickers and this is freestyle, which I wish I read the description a little better because I honestly thought my brain was thinking freestyle. Cool. Maybe it's just, Oh, that's awesome. Freestyle. Meaning it's just the stickers. Oh no. You get 48 colors. Cause I thought that's great. This would be a great way to use your spares. Nope. We're going to get 48 colors. And they're all DMC. And they're art top, so they're nice with quality. You've got all the colors of the rainbow. And that's black for outlining. So, there's that. I'm not going to stick down. But I thought it'd be fun to do the stickers. Because it kind of shades it and shows you... Like, if you want this to show up, to obviously do this in a little bit darker shade. To do the outline in black so it shows up and pops nice. But there's all sorts of butterfly. There's a... This be a lollipop. Another lollipop. Another butterfly. A piece of candy. A flamingo. A paw print. A rainbow. A flower. A boat. Leaf, planet, another flower, lotus, I think. I mean, just really cute. This would be a great, uh, like, if you want to have a party, so you know, your you know, teardrop, peace sign, smiley face, another flower, cupcake. Like, if you want to have, like, a activity at a kid's party or like say you're having like a girl's night out you know girl's night out but it you know do you want an activity to do like if you're going somewhere and you're doing like a girl's trip you could definitely take something like this and you could teach your friends and family that are going with you and hanging out or like something to do on a rainy day at the beach teach other people you know, if you're like going to your beach house or going camping, it'd be a nice small kit to take with you. And you don't have to use the drills essential. You can use your spares. It is round, so you could use whatever spares. So you could definitely use whatever ABs. But this is what I thought was interesting. Um, it's a very nice description instructions. It shows you nice pictures of what it all is. Um. And I had to go back on Amazon to look at what this is. And it showed a picture. You can connect these trays. No stop for that. Little spout is where they're supposed to come out. But yeah. I thought that was kind of cool. Blue wax. The blue sparkly pen. And it's really light blue. Blue grippy. And then a replacer. 
A very nice, it even says what's on there. What's in your baggie, right on the, right on the front. You know, no baggies, no excessive, no tweezers, no nothing that you don't need. Like this is a very nice toolkit. And they do have a couple of different diamond paintings. They had a, I think a long one of butterflies and there's something else. But they, um, when I saw a diamond painting, Art Dot used to have like the four packs of stuff. So they would have like a four pack of a scenery, so there's four different sceneries, four different animals, four different, um, whatever the grouping was before of the same kind of category. So I thought that was kind of fun that they came out with some fun stickers and they made it so that way you don't have to go and follow. You can decide what colors you want, what colors you like. You know, you can make it in, you know, because there's, looks like there's two of each in there. Most of them look like there's at least, at least two of each of them. If not all of them have two, the majority of them have two. So you can make one one way and then make one a totally different color way. But, excuse me. I mean, you could definitely make it your own. I thought that was fun. So... Hopefully they come out with other sticker kits come holidays coming up. That would be fun. You know, just something to look for. I mean, they have great containers. They have the boxes and the ones with the canvas that have the handle on it. They have all sorts of stuff. And I got this on Amazon. And I believe you can also go to the Art Dot website. And they have, if you want, the trays with the, sh you know, the little shelving unit with the trays to put your jars in. Yeah, dog. I have light the pads, all sorts of stuff. So, I thought that'd be fun to try out and do. So, I ordered from Michael's and I didn't realize the one I, other one I ordered was a pickup and I kind of got a chance to get to Michael's. So, and this I believe is Oh, crafting spark. I never heard them. I thought they were similar to the, um, what is it? The one with the wood company. What's the name of that company? I don't know. I can't think of it right now. So, it's a giant couple of bags or grills. There is no regular toolkit. Obviously, they're already kitted up, but they did give you a pair of tweezers. And here's some instructions. And this is a square. It's only a little. What is it? A twenty. Twenty by thirty. So it's really small. And it's this cute little colorful owl with a flower. So these are the ones that are labeled with your DMC. Some pretty colors. And not seen uh, yeah it's even kind of like uh, oh yeah it wasn't even that company that had the awful squares that's what that chart looks like okay so if you've never done a
double sided adhesive. It's an upgraded chart. It's actually in color. You can see very well. Uh, but there's only one sided. And it's double sided adhesive. The adhesive goes way over the edge of where it is. I mean, it's very nice symbols. I can totally read those. But there's bubbles in it. We're going to have to use the tweezers and very carefully get that bubble out. So, so it's not my favorite. Okay, so I will show you the name again. It's up here, Crafting Spark. Um, I mean, it is packaged very nicely with a nice box like they're supposed to be on the shelf. Uh, you know, it has a little thing like they could be on the shelf at Michael's, but they're not. They're just on the website. So, buyer beware. If you do not like double-sided adhesive, it looks like, yeah, see, it shows right on the box. But I've had directions from so many other kids that shows that because they just haven't updated pictures to make it look like it's supposed to be but yeah um I mean it's a very nice box it's got the picture of it it's a regular it looks like a you know diamond dot box but yeah yeah double side adhesive I mean luckily like I said this is small so I will give an honest review and you know, keep it under stuff to keep it flat. So obviously I can't put it back in the box. It is technically kitted up, but I don't like. See, normally if it was poured glue, I would roll it back up and put it back away. But it's not. And we, we, I think this bag's so huge. Mm. This bag is just huge. I mean, just excessive for the drill. But I obviously get up in boxes. I don't normally work on the bags. But yeah, so there was that. So, if you don't like double sided adhesive, I would check. I'm going to go back and look on the Michaels website, on their app, and see if it says it anywhere on there, because I'm going to do it, give it a chance, see if it turns out nice, but I just, I don't like it. I don't like double sided adhesive. I've never, ever liked double sided adhesive. I find it very frustrating, very infuriating to work on, so we'll see. That's what I got. That's my unboxing. It's my review. And if you have any questions, go ahead and leave a message or YouTube things. And remember, Diamond Pink's fun. It's for relaxation. It's for having a nice creative time and doing something you enjoy and sharing your art with others. And have a time with Bye.